Uh, hello again, guys. This will be the last week for our for um for preseason, and and yeah, this will be the last one. And I'm gonna actually take this game and experiment with a different playbook since it's the last preseason game. And I'm doing that because I feel like the Del Rio playbook that I have doesn't really... I, I'm not really caring for it that much. I'm going to try Run Balance for this one and see what happens. Because... Because well, it had the don't. There's nothing really wrong with it. It's just I feel like I feel like I sh I feel like the plays I, I'm picking aren't really working with me. They're not fitting. I'm not comfortable with them. And of course, I'm going to kick first. See, if I can just tie with Tennessee, I could live with that for the preseason. But I really need to win this game. And before we get too far ahead, let's take a look at the Redskins. Oh fuck, I forgot to check out the matchup thing. God damn it. Oh well, um, I'm not gonna worry about it. I got a depth chart. Alright, Ramsey, young quarterback, um, awareness. I remember, he has a cannon for an arm, but he is like slow as fuck, so... Trug candidate. <laughs> they don't really have anyone for running backs. They're young guys and candidates super fast. I guess he's a receiving running back. Is my guess. And then Brian Johnson is their fullback and he's a slightly above average. Uh, Laverne's Coase and Rod Gardner are very solid uh, uh, wide receivers. And Taylor Jacobs is a rookie, and he shows promise as well. So pretty good there. They have no one for tight ends, like no one. Um, they got Awesome Beast, Chris Samuels at left tackle. Left guard slightly above average. Center is below average. Their right guard is a beast. And their right tackle, John Jansen, is a fucking beast as well. And then Ronaldo wins slightly above average. That doesn't really offer much there. Regan Upshaw is starting for Bruce Smith. <laughs> Bruce Smith is still around in this game. You could play as the legendary Bruce Smith. And Bruce Smith is better, but he's old as fuck, though. He's 40. But I'm lucky there. Um, Dan Wilkinson, he's slightly above average. And Brandon Noble is tied with Jeremy, Jeremy Haley. I don't know which one's better, but they're both kind of uh, average. Number 51's a beast, I guess. I mean, I don't know who he is, but... Trot Trotter is fucking, fucking badass here. Um, and Jesse Armstead's very awesome, too, here. But he's old, though. Champ Bailey, the man. Fred Smooth is a very solid number two cornerback. And Smolden's a nice nickel. So... Corners I'm worried about. Free safety, Matt Bowen. He's only slightly above average. I can deal with him. And same thing with O'Halady. And then Hall is okay and Barker's average. So I'm I'm looking pretty good here. I'm not too worried here. I think I can handle the Redskins here. They're not terribly stacked in any one area. And I feel like I feel like I deserve to to get this one here. The receivers worry me a bit, but I think... I think if I can just... Fuck! Good 
good. Stopped him. All right, let's get him. Come on. All right, they're definitely not running the ball here. It's gonna be a, probably gonna be a short pass. Here we go. But yeah, the combination of Ramsey's cannon of an arm and their two very solid receivers, you gotta watch out for that. Um, but if you can shut down their passing game, they have nothing for a running game, really. They have great linemen, but their running backs are are barely average. So if you can shut if you can shut down that, you should be pretty solid. All right. Run, this is the run balanced offense. Sweet. Let's keep running it. Ah, fuck, that was a terrible call. There we go. Oh, come on! No! I'm challenging that. I don't know if it's right or not, but I can't, I don't want to turn it over here. Yes, thank you. I can control field position and that really helps even if I don't score on the drive ah that's that was awful punt damn it There we go. Oh, fuck. Who got hurt? Cardi. Fuck. Uh, I need to pass. Oh, 
Oh wow, they put the second string in already. Put in the last game? Jeez. Okay. Damn it, come on! Okay, they got the... Oh, good. Awesome. I'll let them have this one, but then I'm going to call in timeouts after this. So I can try to sneak in a score. Unless that happens. Alright, he's okay. He'll be fine. Sweet. Ah, fuck. I thought he was covered. Oh, well. Damn it. I didn't like that play. I like this one. Fuck. Damn it. Oh, come on, really? Just a great punt return there, John. And then he just ran out of speed. But I'll tell you this, he gave a great field position. Hey, I know they want to increase the lead before half. But they got to be careful and not let the other team back in or not turn it up. Like you're on first down. Oh, come on. Yes, Westmoreland, thank you. Let's look for Alright, so there's no split there's no shotgun formations in this. So that makes me a bit worried. I think I may go to balance formation so I can have a little bit of everything.
Oh, shit. God damn it, really? Let's do a play action. Throw it deep to Hayes. Good. If I can get in field goal range, I'd be happy. They're trying to get in range for a last second field goal attempt before halftime. Get set. Pressure. He surveys the field. Gets rid of it. Jumps up and comes down with it. And he's tackled at the 23. Yeah, I used all my timeouts. I can live with that. Going to weekend halftime tied. Fuck. I fucked up the accuracy. Shit! Fuck me! Come on! I fucked it up! Damn it. Alright, at least I get to return it. Damn it. I fucked that up. There we go. I should have slowed down and let him block for me. Ah, I made the same mistake again. Fucked. I fucked it up. God, my power's off. It's not gonna make it. Nope. I fucked it up again. Shit. Oh, 
short pass to the right side. Excellent game on first down. These guys are just out there playing a little pitch and catch. They make them look easy. Fuck me. Damn it. Well, I can still... I'll find a way. Thank you. And don't be surprised if they look in his direction again. He's not just a solid lead blocker. He can hurt you in the passing game, too. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the Redskins ahead of the Jaguars 10-0. Damn it. Fuck, come on, really? I hate my life. <laughs> Damn it, come on, really? Number 32, a nice run. They picked up the first down. It was well executed. They hit their blocks in the back, found the right hole to get down the field and pick up a first down. This one is just about in the book. Sets up. 
shit. Who got hurt? Tony Brackens. God damn it. Damn it. Fuck me. Maybe I can get a safety. That will that'll make me a bit happier if I got a safety here. Fuck. Yes, Stroud! <laughs> ah, yes! Oh. Awesome. Thank you, Stroud. That, that helps. That makes me feel a whole lot better. Now I just gotta... See if I can get an onside. Damn it. They don't need to run any type of play here. The quarterback oh well. with a kneel down. I should have had this game. If I made the field goals, I would have had this game. Yep, another loss. God. Oh well, it's just a preseason. Run balance did not work for me. It was great for running the ball, but when I needed to score, it didn't do shit for me. I think balance would be the best way to go. Because I have balance before. Balance has a great option of run plays, but also has a decent amount of pass plays too. All right, let's advance here. All right, let's read our progression while we're at it. There we are. Mark Brunel's too old to make progression. Brian made progression, but let's see. Stronger, more, his awareness rose, his strength rose, his agility rose. Q 
Carrying rows. Throwing accuracy rows, that's good. Stamina rows. Injury rows, that's good too. Toughness rows. His injury rows, Gerard. I'm gonna look at Gerard too for shits and giggles. I'm gonna look at all of them actually. Halfback. Nothing for Fred Taylor, he's too high up. Tofield's a rookie, so. Uh, Elvis Joseph, let's take a look at both. Nothing really for Tofield. His injury rose, which is good. Elvis's injury rose a little bit, but let's look at other things. Nothing there. Fullback, nothing rose for him. Jimmy Smith, he's old and he's high, he's, nothing's gonna rise for him. Same thing with Willie, and JJ Stokes too. Donald Hayes, Ross rose quite a bit. Let's look. Strength, awareness rose, agility, acceleration, his catch rose, carrying rose, jumping rose, break tackle rose. Man, he did ha, did pretty well for himself here. His stamina rose, his injury rose, his toughness rose. Let's look at Jermaine Lewis now. Tight end, nothing. Lazar and Reitster. Let's look at those two. Awareness rose, agility rose. Pass blocking rose, that's good. His injury resistance rose, that's good. Let's look at him. His injury resistance rose, that's good too. And that's really it. Alright, let's look at left tackle. Left tackle, he had some improvements. Jordan doesn't, but let's look at him. Pearson, his agility and acceleration rose. His stamina rose, his in resistance to injury rose. So, not a lot, but a little. Let's look at Vince Mahani. Nothing for Nesbitt. Let's see. Stamina injury rose, that's good. But nothing else. Let's look at the center. Nothing for him. Let's look at the young guy here. Something rose for him. Stamina... An injury rose. Inser, nothing. Actually, he's old too, but no, wait. No, he's young. Both those guys didn't rise. You know, didn't rise, and let's look at Cadilla, or whatever his name is. Stamina and injury rose quite a bit for injury. Let's look at Maurice Williams. Nothing for Humphrey, but let's look at Maurice Williams. Um... Injury rose, but that's it. Man, not a lot on the line. That's Coleman, he's old. Nothing's gonna rise for him. Douglas is very good. Nothing's gonna really he doesn't need much. Tony Brackens doesn't need anything. Spicer. Man, nothing among the ends. Looks like a D tackle. Henderson, Stroud, nothing for Smith. So let's look at these two. Henderson, his overall rose, which is good. His agility rose. His tackling rose, that's great. Um Stamina rose, his resistance to injury rose, awesome. Let's look at Stroud now. His overall rose, that's awesome. His awareness rose. His agility rose, his acceleration rose, that's all good right there. Tackling rose, awesome. Stamina and injury rose, that's awesome. Danny Clark and Mitchell, nothing there, but let's look at a Codell, a Oyedell, Aiken right here. <laughs> uh, let's see. Injury Rose, that's the only thing. Let's look at middle linebacker, nothing for Peterson, nothing for Slaughter, nothing for T Puff. Let's look at right outside, nothing. Westmoreland, his stuff rose. It's so Awareness Rose, which is good. Gildy Rose, Acceleration Rose, his Tackling Rose, good. Stamina Rose and his Injury Rose. Okay, if he kept, keeps it up, he might be decent. He's impressed me a little bit. All right, Bryant, nothing for Bryant, nothing for Kraft, nothing for Thomas, nothing for Trap. Mantis Rose, that's good. 68, Strength is Rose, Awareness, Agility, Acceleration. Jumping rows, tackling rows, stamina rows, and injury rows, and toughness rows. 
free safety. Nothing for battles, but McCree, his overall rose one, his strength rose, his awareness rose, his agility rose, his acceleration rose, his tackling rose, stamina rose, and his injury rose, and his toughness rose. Good. So nothing for him. Darius, he's already good enough. Nothing for Cardi. Nothing for Richie, and nothing for Hanson. Okay. Okay, let's advance. Alright, and let's save this like always. And yeah, that was the last week. Um, overall, I would say for preseason mode in general, it's pretty helpful to get used to the plays, figure out playbooks and all that stuff. Now, my experience with it, for this one, I have to say that I did not do super well. I'm a bit nervous going to the regular season about winning enough games to get into playoffs without having to do games over. I'd rather not do that, but I will for the sake of the review. But, but I think... I think I have a good team going forward. I just gotta, I just gotta find the right playbook, and I just gotta play smart, and I gotta just correct mistakes in the preseason. But yeah, uh, tune in next time. We'll cover owner's box and all the other goodies in regular season mode. But yeah, um, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like the videos, and have a good day.